Baby, give me brain. Yeah. Baby, go insane. Yeah. Let me switch lanes. Yeah. Go a different pace. Uh -huh. Man, I'm on a plane. Yeah. Man, I can't complain. Yo, first class game. Yeah. Too much money game. Okay, guys. As you see by the title, I'm doing something I was supposed to do months ago. We never got to it. Six speed auto shift knob adapter. I'm gonna be testing on my 370Z. Also picked up the Blue Pearl shift knob, which is very clean. You guys see it. But what I'm also gonna add into this video, just cause got some more quick bump releases in the Silver Neo Chrome to match with the uh, spike lug nuts that I have. And since everything else has that Neo Chrome uh, glow on it, this also comes in the package. But let's get right to it. Finally installing the oh, shift knob. is the Truasara. However you say it, the hearts. My one in the rear fell off since I'm lowered now. I also got one for the inside, a black one, so I'm gonna put this on too. So you're inside the Z. You see this, this stock shift knob here, Team Auto. So first things first, you wanna pull this down. It's a little clip piece and should have been a clip behind there, but there isn't. But you wanna do that. Is the clip still in? I'm supposed to be able to pull this off, but I think the clip is still in, mate. One second. All right, so there's this clip behind here. You want to pull it out. You don't want to lose any of these little pieces, so make sure you put it somewhere nice and secure. And then next, ah! should be able to slip it off just like that. So there is the stock shift knob. And we're going to test out this adapter. Also comes with the Allen keys and everything. So test that out real quick. So just in case you ever want to put it back, I would recommend putting this little clip back on it just for now until uh, you ever want to use it back again. So next, you pull this up and then you'll see I have the 14 millimeter out. This is 14 millimeter, and then this is the 16 millimeter. Comes in the bag, so I'm guessing you can choose either size depending on how long um, you want it to be. But you guys see, there's this little hole right here, and in that little hole is where you guys will be putting in your Allen screw that comes with it into the adapter. So it's gonna be kind of hard to show while I'm doing it, but you basically have it like this. Right through the middle. Actually, hold on. Let's see if I can show this a certain way. recommend is the 14 millimeter since it's not as loose as the other one to put into here so real quickly I'm gonna basically you see the hole here at the bottom basically gonna have it tighten in like that right through the middle where the the hole is at the bottom it's gonna come up of course a little bit more so probably somewhere around here and then I'm gonna have this, and then I'm gonna use the Allen key. Sorry about that angle, I'm using one hand. I'm gonna use the Allen key and the screw and tighten it in right through there to the middle so it can hold. So let's do that real quick. What I did was, um, took the screw, put it inside the little hole inside the adapter, and then now all I have to do is tighten it up real quick and then put this thing on. Have it locked into place. So this will be your push down. And then right now, all I'm gonna do is uh, tighten it up some more till it's fully tight. You see right there, it's fully tight. As you see, it's more all the way down now. The bottom piece, that's the 14 millimeter. And you wanna tighten that up, but you want it to be able to still have that push 
when you're switching into gears and stuff. So now that that's in, all that's left is to add this nice shift knob. And six speed also has a bunch of other ones. There's long shift knobs, shorter shift knobs, um, a bunch of other cool options that are there. So after that, literally, switch into gears. You guys see, I mean, it gives off a whole different look. Let me zoom out real quick. See the reflection off my radio. It looks really nice. So now we're gonna test it out real quick. I'm gonna turn on the car for a second. Hopefully my neighbors don't care. Guys, me. this was really that simple. It took me only five minutes. Let's turn on the car. Let's see. There goes reverse. bumper releases that's something very easy to something simple i've shown it on the channel already but guys this is i can't fake once i figure out the full interior you know start changing up the steering wheel and stuff like that it's gonna look lit but it's all coming together now guys say i was gonna turn it around show you guys real quick it still works the same way just that the little middle piece will be on the inside i should have did that from the beginning but guys this is how it looks Man, it's lit. Yeah. So now I can switch them out. 16. I forget the dimensions for this. I can uh, leave a link in the bio for them, but I think it's for the 370Z. 16 by 1.25 or something like that. Um, I'll leave a description, the, the link, or if anybody wants to know which one I exactly I got, please let me know in the comment section below and I'll give you guys the links for the exact things I got from uh, Six Speed. But yes, guys, it's lit. So, just to prove, still works. That's drive, neutral, reverse, and park. Yeah, I can see. I can smell the E85. <laughs> it's strong as crap. Yeah, guys, it's lit. I'm not gonna show too much since this was the video for the uh, shift knob only, but it's really simple to do as you see in my other video. Got the Allen key, literally about to screw it out. All you do is literally hold it, screw the other side in, put the little nut on the back end, tighten it. That's really it, guys. It's really simple to do, so I'm gonna do this real quick. It's literally pissing me off and I don't know how to take it off. It's only one left. The bumper. That's those two. And then on this side, I can't get the top one off for right now. So it's just gonna have to stay a different color. My little helper. But yeah, that's it for now. Um, I think, actually, I don't know if I showed it. The little JDM heart on the inside too. And then I have the one in the rear. So it looks really good, guys. I'm gonna put these on and try to get the other one later. Amazing. But that is the end of this video. That's really it. It's nothing too big of a deal. I figured it out eventually. It's your boy Mighty Will signing out. Cool.
super spacious, 3, 2, 1, I'm blessing. We take off and go anywhere, girl, let go to 